Now he's Adam Armstrong. Hutchinson. Who finds the pass infield to Flynn Downs. Downs is going to go for goal, but he drags his right foot an effort wide. In that channel, as he often does. The Australian now being supported by Leif Davis coming onto it, and Davis with the first time effort. And now Jackson with the cross. Keeper Moore holds the ball up. To Nzebe, can't quite get the ball to have a go. Adam Armstrong, who was at Ipswich as well a few years ago. Can he turn provider against his ex club? Chaplin. Jackson into the penalty area, and Leif Davis was coming in at the back post. It's cleared away only as far as Sam Morsey. Davis holding his position. Here is the left back now, still inside the penalty area. Left foot and effort. Oh, what a strike from Leif Davis! But Leif Davis has managed to find the back. Looks to respond immediately for Southampton. Cut back to Rebo and Adams. Is he offside? Well, the flag has stayed down on that far side. Cam just can't believe it. Everybody, he's had a shot. No, he's on site. It's a good decision. He's on site. It is a good decision. Leif Davis, who just moments earlier put Ipswich a goal to the good, is the man. Play back to one all. They're a bit tired, and I'm sure we'll get some joy in that if we keep the high press up. Well, it was from the high press. Stuart Armstrong moves away from Jackson, threads it through to Adam Armstrong, and Adam Armstrong makes it 2 1. That is clinical. Well, what a through ball! It had to be perfect to find him. It had to be in time. That's a bit of a surprise as well, in truth. Saints have a 2-1 lead. One of the free kick is not given. And they could take advantage here. And they I've been impressed with them. They've been so fluid. They've gone forward. They take a lot of chances just to three of them at the back and they push people forward. If they get by the high high press, they have got Ipswich Town outnumbered. And that's what's causing the problem. 39 appearances in all competitions, 21 goals for Ali Alhamidi, and then Jackson goes down inside the penalty area. He turns in the direction of Martin, trying to win the ball off the Australian. Wolfenden. In against Che Adams, and handball has been awarded against Southampton's number 10, much to the delight. The Southampton number 10, and well, Morsi was late there. They won't want to be conceding a, a third goal against the, the Southampton side that's purring at the moment. Now that is a foul by Jack Stevens on Connor Chapman here. Really interesting, but it just over the bar it comes. And there's Morsi, the Wolverhampton born. Harwood Bellis. Strong. Trying to link up with. Adam Armstrong again. Armstrong bouncing it back to Arebo. Here's Adam Armstrong, right hand side this time, advanced position, right by the byline. Plays. Harwood Bellis making a run towards the penalty spot, but Burgess can head away. Arebo, now Stuart Armstrong threads it through. Stevens saved by Hackey. This time the flag does go on. Three to a rebo. Oh, good work from with Bellis in there too. And it's flicked on. And it's somehow tipped behind. Into the first contact. A rebo just outside the penalty area. Finds Adams. Adams dinks it in towards Adam Armstrong. Side for Southampton. Stuart Armstrong. Linking up with Ryan Fraser. Fraser's the wrong side of Tuan Zebe. And Fraser hits the deck. Expecting a, a free on the attack. This is promising for the Saints. Downs into Fraser and then Hackey makes the save. What an opportunity. He's not a, a naturally uh, attacking fullback. So just uh, an image here on what's twinged Jan Bednarek. Um, but like I say, link 
link-up play, Chaplin Broadhead and Al Hamadi all involved, and I think he just slipped at a crucial moment as well, you know. Yeah, it's good play. That, that you see from Davis to Taylor, that pass there is perfect for... Adam Armstrong. Armstrong couldn't get to the return. Decision here. Al Hamadi waiting and waiting. And in the end it comes to nothing, but this is Chaplin. And a really, really good opportunity for Ipswich. To things. Oh, Armstrong almost found a way. There's Brooks. Brooks with that ball through. Stevens forward. And it's Adam Armstrong trying to force it home. Richardson hit the deck just outside the box. He was fouled. Jack Stevens pulls him back because Stevens is wrong side of him. He expects Lee Davis to play it to Hutchinson and he fouled. Bozy will get to it. Brooks and Adam Armstrong are all waiting inside the box here for Southampton. Adozi, then trying to find a way through. Adozi moving for that, but from an offside position. And Ipswich Town get the free kick. Davis is the outlet here. Trying to get him behind Bree. Haston Bree brings him down. Players to get him off the hook in terms of red. But the referee did not see it that way. Broadhead having a look at it. Taylor is there too. It's rolled to Broadhead. And the wall. Hampton will be seven points behind the top two. But also with a couple of games in hand. But Ipswich are looking for the winner here. It's Lee Davis on the charge again. It's Broadhead. It's deflected. Adozi picks up the baton. But one is ahead of him, including Adam Armstrong. The flag stays down. Brooks with the flick, he's gone for the return behind Davis, and he delivers the ball into a brilliant area. And how many goes down? And it's David Brooks, and then he runs back to make that challenge, but the referee... Has... Leave Davis, and he's stuck on it again! Sammy Atoll! The strength of character for Mipswich is there for all to see. 2-1 you know, down, really struggling, yet they've just managed points for them. No matter where Ed Sheeran is right now, he will have hurt the Raw League. He's unbelievable. A box office game.